Hello everyone, in the previous video I told you that we are gonna add custom fonts with different weight. Here this is what we have so far in previous videos. For now let's go to the Google Fonts website and download some fonts. Mm -hmm. Here we need two fonts for port and for the person name. I'm gonna download this Gaigu font. Did I say it correctly? I hope so. For this person name I'm gonna choose Tajabal font I don't know how to spell it Tajabal or something find something that you like now both fonts are selected here you can press download button you will get a zip file open that zip file go to Gaigo font here we have with variance weight I'm not going to add all of these to our project because that will make our APK size larger so I'm only gonna select light and regular copy paste into another location because we cannot add files in C directly to the ID or VS code now copy those two fonts and find the assets directly that we created in the part 1 video if you watching this video for the first time create the asset folder otherwise you can go to the part 1 and watch that video and create another directory called fonts inside the asset directory and paste those two fonts to this fonts folder Likewise, I'm going to copy this Tajwal, light and medium and regular and bold fonts. Now we have to specify these images in pubspec.yaml file. Bottom of the file, you can see comments for fonts. So let's add font section. Now in the next line, add dash or hyphen. It says here we need to specify the font name using family colon first one is Gaigo and fonts property and fonts property to specify fonts in the next line type dash it says asset colon it says fonts are in assets forward slash fonts forward slash font name is Gaigo regular dot ttf now in the next line we can specify the font weight for this font so font is light so i'm gonna add weight as 200 likewise i'm gonna add regular font weight is 500 this is one font family name let's add second one family is tajwal fonts are light medium and regular And for weight, I'm gonna add 500 for regular, 300 for medium, and 100 for light. Now click package gate. Now go to the main.dart file and for the text widget, add the style property if you haven't did that yet. And for the textile, we have added white color in the first video. Now we need to change the font. To change the font inside the textile, after the color property, add font family property and as the value, add the font name because font family accept type of string. For the code, I need Gaigo font, add a comma. Let's increase font size 22.0 is enough now press hot reload yep that's great let's delete some text hot reload yeah good we have one more thing to do that is we need to add person name in bottom right corner that's mean we need another text widget or we need multi-child layout widget because of that i'm gonna replace this align widget with a column widget Now we can add another text widget for the person name. Before the first text widget, add another one. Text is I'm gonna cut and paste the name from quote. Add the style property. New text style. Color is white. Font size is 15.0. Font family is Tajawal. Is that right? Yeah. 
phone page is W300. I need some letter spacing. Zero point five is enough. Press for preload. That's better. Here we want this name to be right corner and we want some padding to the top of the name. So to do both of these, I'm gonna wrap this text get with a container widget. Text widget is a child now and I'm gonna add alignment property value is alignment dot bottom right and add padding property we only want to add padding to top of the name so value is const edge inset dot only open and close bracket inside tops colon 10.0 okay press hot reload yeah cool right Keep remember if you change the font without press for preload button, press restart because sometimes you can't see the changes of font. Okay, that's it for this tutorial. So leave a comment if you have any problem. Press like button if you enjoyed this video. Also press subscribe button to get notified when I upload the new video. And it's a very big help for you doing for me. So thanks for watching. See you in the next video. Bye for now.